so this year at the King of Hammers race, we uh, ran into the guys from Dynajet. And uh, in a previous video, we installed a programmer, tuner, whatever you want to call it, into our Razor 1000 and our Razor Turbo. As in that video, it was a huge difference. What we did was the tuner, the Vision Dynajet tuner, has the ability to data log, which is allows you to get in your vehicle and drive it the way you drive it and record all of the telemetry of what your engine and turbo and the clutch is doing. After installing the Dynajet, some of the people at Dynajet ask us to send them two or three of our data logs from each machine and we did. And from that information, Dynajet was able to tell me on my turbo that I had a broken slider in the clutch. The machine only has about 2,000 miles on it, and this time, at that time, I decided it was uh, probably the right time to go through the clutch. Uh, opened the clutch, sure enough, just like Dynajet showed, told me from the telemetry that I sent them, I had a broken slider. That's impressive that they can diagnose my car off of a graph that I sent them on an email. These guys are on the ball. They're not just selling a tuner. They know what the tuner's doing. Chuck at Dynajet walked me through the process and I went ahead and ordered a clutch kit from them. Their clutch kit is very, very nice, very, very simple. I did not have to remove the clutch entirely to install the kit. We're not gonna bore you with the installation of the kit. There's hundreds of videos on the internet showing you how to install everybody's clutch kit and basically the install process is the same. You do need some tools to do the job. Uh, we have some pictures of the parts and the components that will be embedded in the video as long as we're uh, talking about it. We're not going to film you know 30 minutes of an install. This is a very simple install. If you're this far along into putting in a clutch kit, you've done your homework and you know how to put it in. It's as simple as removing the center bolt and the washers from the secondary clutch and installing a, a spring. And you need a compression tool to compress that secondary spring back in to the unit. The primary consists of a spring and three weights. Now these weights in the picture I'm showing you are factory weights. The Dynajet weight has holes in it and they have magnets that drop into the holes to customize the weight for your tire weight, tire size, conditions you're riding, and altitude. This kit is multi-purpose. It can, it can adapt to your riding style. The, sec, the primary clutch was six bolts and a very light spring pressure. I did not need a special tool for that. And it was just removed and then there are some 12 millimeter bolts with a captive nut and you undo this bolt and remove this little nut on the end and you just slip the weights in. You do not have to remove the clutch from the machine. Cleaned up the clutches, blew them out, inspected the rest of the clutches, they look great. Recontacted Dynajet. They asked me to do some dy uh, data logs runs with the, the new clutch kit in it. I did. They had me make a couple of small adjustments. More data logs till I got an email back saying the machine is operating perfect. Chuck at Dynajet. This guy's good. He knows his stuff. He knows what these machines are capable of and knows what they can do without overexerting them or putting unnecessary torque and wear on them. Dynajet clutch kit, Dynajet tuner, swear by it 100%, no issues. Made my machine easier to drive, more power, and just a pleasure to deal with a company like this. If you're gonna buy a tuner, you're gonna buy a clutch kit, buy it from Dynajet. They know what, you're, what they're selling you. They do all of their own R&D. They're not just selling somebody's prod product that they don't know anything about. Again, Dynajet. This company is awesome. 
We appreciate your views. We need all the subscribers we can get. Please subscribe. That's what keeps us going. And hope you enjoyed the video and hope it was helpful to you. And if you need some help with some Dynajet merchandise you've bought, leave me a message in the comments and we'll get you in contact with the right people. Thanks again for watching.